Hi guys, this is Elsa here. As you know, Apple has recently released iOS 17.2.1 to the public. So today we will learn how to jailbreak iOS 17.2.1 and install cool tweaks like changing the lock screen of your iPhone to something like this or getting very cool screen transition effects like this. With this jailbreak, you will get an untethered Cydia or Cilio, meaning that the jailbreak will work even if you restart your iPhone or iPad. And it works for all the iPhones and iPads, including the latest iPhone 15 lineups. So don't miss a beat and let's get started. First, let me show you the current iOS version installed on my iPhone. As you can see, it's the latest 17.2.1. Before jailbreak, we need to perform few steps. Since Apple does not allow jailbreak, there are a few settings within iPhone that will block the jailbreaking. So let me show you how to get your device ready for the jailbreak. First of all, go to Settings, then go to General Option. Background App Refresh, choose this option here, which is Wi-Fi and Mobile Data. In the next step, you have to go back to Main Settings page. Then scroll down and go to this option which says Battery. Here, you need to make sure that the low power mode is turned off. If it's turned on like this, you will see a yellow color within the battery icon. So, make sure to turn off this option. Now in this last step, go back to main settings page. Scroll down and choose the app store option. Here you have to make sure this automatic downloads option is turned on. If it's turned off, you won't be able to download Cydia or Cilio after the jailbreak. That's it guys! That's everything you have to do to make sure that your device is ready to be jailbroken. Now open up Safari Browser and visit this link, iosuncover.com. Please be sure that the letter O within Uncover is zero. So it's iosunc0ver.com. I will add website link in description, comment, and over this video screen for you. So, this is how the new Uncover Web Jailbreak tool looks like. Here you can see it has automatically detected the iOS version of my iPhone. So, the first step would be to jailbreak the iPhone remotely, and then install the Uncover app which in turn will install the Cydia or Cilio for us. So go ahead and click on the jailbreak button. Now, there is a social locker. Since this website offers free jailbreak tool, in exchange, to download Uncover Jailbreak, you need to do their sponsored social survey. You can do Facebook or Twitter share or YouTube subscribe. It's all up to you. Here, I will demonstrate how to do YouTube subscribe. Go ahead and click on this YouTube icon and you will be redirected to a YouTube channel. First, you need to click on the subscribe button and then make sure to turn on the notification on to all. Once everything is done, go back to the browser and you should see the download button has been unlocked. Click on download. It will then ask a permission to download Uncover Configuration Profile. Click allow. Alright, the Uncover Configuration Profile has been downloaded and now it needs to be installed. So go back to home screen, then go ahead and open up settings. Now, you need to click on profile downloaded button which you can find on top of the settings. Here, you will need to choose install option, then enter your iPhone passcode if required. Click next and finally install it. Alright, the uncover profile has been installed now. Go to home screen and open this Uncover app. Please allow some time to load this app completely. Here we go! It has been loaded. So you can see your current iOS version here, which is same as what we checked earlier in settings. Now go ahead and click Start Jailbreak. It will start initiating the jailbreak process. So, the jailbreak has begun. This should be done within a minute. I will quickly fast forward this part. Alright guys, if you have followed the instruction correctly, you should see Cydia or Cilio being extracted from this Uncover app. You will get either Cydia or Cilio depending upon the availability. 
Here, I am getting an option to install Cilio. Don't worry, Cilio has all the tweaks just like Cydia. And Cilio has more advanced UI too. Here it is! Cilio is now downloading on my iPhone. Alright, the Cilio app has been successfully installed. You can now go ahead and open it. There is it guys! I now have a fully working Cilio app on my 17.2.1 device. It's time to install some tweaks. Here, I am going to install a tweak called Cylinder. This tweak will give you really cool home screen icon animations. Currently, there are 45 icon effects. If this animation do not satisfy your needs, then you can create your own animations using Lua. After installing the tweak, you need to respring your device. You can respring using any tweak. Here, I have installed this Respring X tweak. Just open it and click on this Respring button. Alright, now just give it a moment to complete the Respring process. And there it is! Go ahead and unlock your iPhone. Now, all you need to do is just swipe the screen to see the magic. There it is! As you can see, I am getting a lot of cool screen transition effects. You can change these effects from settings under Cylinder menu. Here, you can see a lot of cool transitions that you can apply. Just go ahead and play with them. Let me install one more tweak from Cilio. I will be installing Wactus. Wactus is an Android-inspired lock screen tweak, changing the look of time, date, and weather information on your iPhone. It provides a highly configurable Android-like interface that gives you the best of both worlds. Just go ahead and install the tweak. Once it's installed, you will need to respring your device. Alright guys, as you can see, my lock screen has been transformed into an Android style. This tweak adds a dedicated preference pane to the settings app from where you can access all options. There is an option to toggle the tweak on and off and configuration options for each displayed element on your device's lock screen. This is really cool, guys! So, this is how you can easily jailbreak 17.2.1. As mentioned, I have tested this jailbreak enough to call it a stable version. I will be keep updating the site for future variants of iOS 17. If you have any issue, just comment below and I will help you. Make sure you like this video and subscribe to our channel first. Thanks for watching. Peace.